What's up everybody, peace give it day for you guys, welcome back to the Town Hall 13 Let's Play where we have a open laboratory and a free builder and as well as our clan game reward. So let's hop into that here right now. Let me go over to the progress base and give you guys a look, a gander of what we have going on. Um, so we do have the kingdom and uh, we have the queen warden which is fully maxed which is amazing. Let me bring him over here before I forget so he is fully mapped so we're good on that now we just have the queen king and the royal champion to be maxed out as well so let's hop in here to our clan game rewards and we will be taking up all the stuff that we need we definitely need to get a buggy rooks but let's go on to the first tier so we have gold we have the training potions that we have a lot of and we have 20 gems i'll take the 20 gems because why not um gems are always good to, to have start up especially on a free to play um, account always good to have them um, as well even though I don't have any gems on my 40 no I tend to gem clan castle troops on the town 40 but don't worry about that uh, we're on the second tier and we have dark lit so we have the shovel which isn't too bad and we do have the um, clock tower potion so for this one I'll go with the shovel yes there's dark lit so I think I'll just go with the shovel because right now if I tend up selling them I will probably have like well, 150 gems if I sell them all um, just just if they decide to sell them out um, I don't really have a big problem with dark lit so to, to be honest uh, to be real um, so I will just go with I'll go with that so the third tier we have war rings I will always want to go war rings to be honest the 40 gems is good but war rings are such a big part um, of upgrading new neural level walls with war rings alone war rings are a big they're, they're, they really help you a lot uh, so I'll go with the war rings 100% if you see war rings I would I would definitely take them as well so we have the gold we even have the super potions if you are if you're long super potions and you don't want to have the dark to spend in the um in the sauna I really call it the sauna but where you get the uh, super troops we call I call it the sauna but if you don't have anything to boost the super troops this works really really well but I have a lot of them so I'll just go here with the um, build a potion because they are super super handy to have next off we have some elixir we do have a builder rune though and if I'm thinking of using that rune I really think I should just how I'm looking at it I really think I should use that rune of um, build elixir but what would I spend it on what would I spend it on so I think we're going to use the rune of build elixir and yes I'm going to probably be based on million elixir because I don't think I can upgrade any walls of elixir if I'm 100% sure, yeah, I definitely can't equip any walls of elixir. I don't have the the levels for that, so I will use this rune of elixir. Yes, I'm probably going to be wasting some, but it's totally fine. Use some of that rune of elixir. I will use this boost as well because I know for sure that I'm going to have to be upgrading um, other laboratory groups or even this. To me, I think this is going to be what I'm going to upgrade. So 4.5 million elixir and 3 to 1 ban, which is going to max out my um gonna match up the gems i can potentially get so i think that wasn't a bad thing to use it on to be honest i think it would probably wasn't the best but we use it on that i will take no i will take this and definitely be saving it on that um as well and then for the last of final we'll take that book of heroes and we will claim it there and we do have the extra reward so i will go with this rune of gold as well but those are all the rewards i took 20 gems book of heroes book of uh, rune of gold rune of uh you build elixir four of the war rings builder potion and a, sh a shovel of obstacles i will take that to the bank as well so not bad rewards to claim as well um they're really going to be super super handy for me and i see especially claiming that uh, other rune of Billy elixir I think it wasn't too bad as well. So we do have some of the war rings. They do still take five war rings, sadly. Um, but like I said, we still take the war rings no matter what. Um, no, with the world champion. We're going to be a great world champion. Yes, we probably could get close to Queen, but we really want to knock out this world champion. I really want to get her going and get her done. That's the like main priority. So six and a half day upgrade. And uh, with the Hammer Jam event, it just makes it so much better. Um, as well, so 3, 2, 1, bam, and she's going to level 13, so 7 more upgrades, I will leave the book, I'll keep the book because it's only like 6 days, so I'll just save the book, let her uh, grind out, it's totally fine um, for me, so it doesn't really matter too much for me as well, so 
now we are going in for the last and final upgrade which is the laboratory so we got a lot of options we got all these machines these need all need to go up to mat so see the machines is probably going to be the, like the probably the last couple of things we'll be really be doing in the laboratory we will try to get to them soon uh, but the main things we really want to get is like a lot of these upgrades so we have the giants which isn't bad the dragons as well is something i really need to get going uh, baby dragons mainly for funnel but what I'm doing right now, using the jump spell probably as much as I am now, and looking to use like a lot of smash the jump spells. This jump spell, like I said, um, does work really well, and it is a big part, especially having a longer jump spell and letting your troop be able to take more time and having more time, I should say, to be able to jump over the walls. I think the jump spell is probably the best thing we should do right now, spell wise. We do have the clone and stuff, but I think the jump right now is better. Uh, spell wise because this one I probably may use a little more. I do tend to use the clone spell a lot because I love Electron Lado, Electron in general, but I'm using the jump right now, so I think jump spell right now is the big priority. So, jump spell 12 million, you let serve 15, yet we're in 3 to 1, bam, and that is the jump spell. We let that run. Um, it's course as well for the 15 days, but that's it for me. Hope you guys did enjoy it. I'm gonna keep farming out. Uh, yes, I don't have the builders, but I do. I'm getting a scratch on eight hours, so I will take my time and do a lot of farming and try to try to knock out as much walls as possible. We'll see how things go with that. But that's it for me. Hope you guys did enjoy the collector of the client games and a lot of very good upgrades um, as well to boot. But that's it for me. I'll see you guys next time.